I want to go back one last time to Mike Tirico before we go back to sports. Uh, Mike, of course, is our sports anchor. Uh, Mike, this is this is a person who, to me, seemed like a mentor to others, seemed to really care about the future of, of the sport. Okay, that was definitely part of the final chapter of Kobe Bryant uh, as a player and then emerging into as a businessman over time here. Uh, you know, th there were times go back to when he and Shaquille O'Neal, in the year after Michael Jordan won six titles in eight years, the next three years were dominated, a uh, one-year space in between, by three consecutive titles with Shaquille O'Neal and Kobe Bryant. And a lot of the story was after that, could they get along together and that they were maybe too big for each other. And in a later chapter, as Kobe won another title after that, two more titles after that in 2009 and 2010, I think after that you started to see Kobe become more of a mentor to some of the players he was around, to the star players in the league. And certainly in this business venture that was the end of his career and post, uh, Kobe was trying to help his people who touched him really as a platform uh, to tell their story and to do good storytelling. He was involved in some media projects as well. I was very much right. involved in the next chapter. Mike, there were a couple of films, Dear Basketball uh, mm -hmm. and Kobe Bryant's Muse. Um, I believe he won awards for at least some of that work. So that was part of his, his latest chapter. That, that is correct. And that's what I was referring to when we discussed the uh, next chapter of his career involving some production. He ended up winning an Oscar for uh, one of the awards that he ended up winning, uh, one of the films, the short film Dear mm -hmm. Basketball, which was t essentially a poem that he put, and that really did explain his um, incredible connection to the game and where that passion derived from that we saw on the basketball floor for 20 years. Mike Tirico, thank you for walking us through the pain today. Uh, such a, a horrible news that we have to share with America. I appreciate you being with us on the phone. I know we'll see you again uh, probably on Nightly News this evening. Thank you. Uh, just to recap for those who are just joining us, NBC News has confirmed with the, with the county manager, city manager rather, of Calabasas, California, that Kobe Bryant, uh, one of the biggest names in the NBA, has unfortunately perished in a helicopter crash in Calabasas, California. Of course, we're going to have much more on all of this and the life of Kobe Bryant, remembering him. All of that will be ahead tonight on NBC Nightly News. We have our reporters heading to the field as well uh, to get the latest information on what exactly happened to bring down that helicopter, as you see the shot there in Calabasas.